Paris Hilton may not have managed to meet her commitment to take on a humanitarian trip to Rwanda. But one thing that couldn't be put back was the heiress's decision to sell her beloved Hollywood mansion and move to somewhere a little less accessible to the clamouring press. The luxury home above Sunset Boulevard was snapped up in 10 days for $4.5 million. Despite her sadness at having to move, she was all smiles at the launch of her newest enterprise, Paris Hilton Clothing, when it was unveiled at popular celebrity boutique Kitson's. We just have a lot of fun clothes. It's really sparkly and they stand out and they're fashionable, they're affordable. Um, a lot of the tees, I designed everything, so it's just very my style. How long did it take you to put this fashion line together? We've been working on this line for the past year, so we already have the other lines that are going to be coming out next month as well, so um, it's great. There have been rumors that her billionaire grandfather had been so appalled by her brattish behavior that he was planning to cut off her $59 million inheritance. But who needs granddaddy's money when you're a past master at cashing in on celebrity? In 2004, Paris received a $100,000 advance for her autobiography, Confessions of an Heiress, a tongue-in-cheek peek behind the pose. Panned by critics for its amateurish writing and lightweight content, it became a New York Times bestseller. After starring in three seasons of the Fox reality series, The Simple Life, Paris had become very convincing in the role of rich, dumb blonde. I'm just here to get some diamonds. <laughs> just got this um, Stella McCartney like bow diamond ring, which I love. It's so cute. Um, they just last forever. When a guy gives you a diamond, you know he really loves you. And they're just, they're beautiful. It's like the, be the best stone, I think, of all of them. It wasn't long before she graduated from small to big screen in the teen screamer House of Wax, for which she was singled out for a Razzie Award. Undeterred, she has pressed on with her acting career and now has three films scheduled for release over the next two years. Looked at all the puppies and um, oh, it's a big camera.